This stadium have witnessed a spectacular African night where Al Ahly succeeded to qualify to the cup finals for the 14th time in history. One more step is left for deciding the 10th star. However, our heroes have to get ready to get back to the top of the table of the Egyptian league this week. I'm Yumnaat when you are watching Al Ahly Online TV English News, getting you an in-depth view of Al Ahly for this week. So let's start with the we are in the CAF Champions League final. Musimani, we deserve to reach the final. Al Ali was held to a 2 to 2 draw against Pyramid. Musimani, I got Egypt's number one goalkeeper. Al Ali managed to reach the CAF Champions League final after defeating Tunisians aspirants 3 0 at Al Ali Wiya Salam Stadium in the semi final second leg. Ali Maloul broke the deadlock in the 38th minute and he netted the opener from the spot. We kept our presence and in the 56th minute, Muhammad Sharif doubled the score before Hassan Shahad, who scored the third in the 62 minute, what gifted us a comfortable 3 0 victory. Betsy Musimani Al Ali head coach expressed his happiness after reaching the CAF Champions League final. Al Ahli put on a strong performance and we managed to reach the CAF Champions League final. Also, I'm so glad to reach the final with Al Ahli for the second consecutive time. We feel good because we are in the final, but we have to be honest, we expect it to be in the final, not only because we are a big team, but because we played to reach the final. We scored three goals against its Mamelodi Sundowns, four against its Aspirants, and five goals against its Widad last year. We are a big team. Al Ali football first team was held to a 2 to 2 draw against Spearmint in match day 27 at Al Ali Wiya Salam Stadium on Thursday. The second half started with a quick goal by Spearmint in the 47th minute of the game as Ibrahim Adel's shot found the net. After a few minutes, Hussein Shahad made his first appearance in the match and was able to equalize the score for the Red Eagles. In the 60th minute of the encounter, Al Ahli was awarded a penalty. However, Malul failed to convert it into the back of the net. After 22 minutes, Kohraba doubled the score for the Red Eagles after coming from the bench. In the dying minutes of the game, Eric was able to equalize the score for Pyramid, ending the encounter in a 2 2 draw. Petsu Musimani Al Ahli head coach spoke after our game against experiments on Thursday in the Egyptian Premier League. We are very unlucky in two moments. Malul missed a penalty and our captain made a big mistake, unlike last week as I saw them shined. I got Egypt's number one goalkeeper. Tonight, you blame Shinawi? No, I stay with my goalkeeper. I stay loyal to Shinawi, who saved us many times. Shinawi is number one. Thanks for watching Al Ahli Online TV English News. From Al Ahli Wiya Salam Stadium, I'm Yumna Atwa. See you next week.